Hey, this is Brant with Vintage Statements, and today we've got a nice piece. Well, will be a nice piece once we're done with it. So stick around, let's see what we can do to make this more modern. All right, overall, this piece may look nice, but it's got a lot of problems that we're gonna have to fix. The door kinda is a little bit shaky. Can't really get it open and closed, so we're gonna have to adjust for that. Glass is here on this side, um, but it's out, so I gotta build a little piece to hold it back into place. On this side, it's all broken. It's got little pieces in there. The drawers seem to work fine, but it's got this ugly felt in it, so we're gonna take all that out. So what we're gonna do, sand it all down, we're gonna figure out what we can do with this top piece. If we're gonna have to just cut it, fill in the void, or if we can save it. So, lots of going on here. Overall, the piece doesn't look like it's been dropped or beat up, except this corner right here, which I can live with. So, we're gonna strip it down, see what we can do. We're gonna leave the glass in most of it here. This is a pretty valuable piece right here, this piece of glass, so we wanna make sure we very careful with it. So, let's get started taking all the hardware off, the door off, figuring out what's going on inside and outside of this piece. Stripped everything down, got the, that velvet or whatever it was in here tearing out. Out of the drawers, we tore it all out. Our top was good, everything's good. I busted out the other glass here. Well, what I mean by busted is I took it out, uh, took the fr subframe out of it, and that way it allowed me to get the shelf out. The other side was broke, so we're gonna leave it out. We're gonna get a match done over the next week. Uh, we're gonna sand everything down. We're gonna paint it. It looks probably nice in the picture, but man, it is uh, it's gunked up pretty bad. It, I don't know what they sprayed on it or what they did to it, but we're gonna smooth it out. We're gonna take care of that. Now there was a mirror up here about this tall, and it was all busted up. So what we did was we created just a back piece here out of the pieces that we had. So we uh, putted in a couple spots here. We're gonna screw it in after we get this all sanded down. And smooth that'll be on the back uh, we'll do the drawers everything like that sand it out 80 grit sandpaper DeWalt sander face mask lots of sand here a lot to get done so take the time sand it out nice get rid of all the gunk on on your project I'm telling you it'll help you once you start painting and you see that finalized piece it'll really uh, look a lot better so let's get started
This project was a lot bigger than I thought. Sanding, fixing, and now taping. But we're to a point where we can now start painting this piece. We've got it all taped off inside and outside. We're gonna paint all of it inside and out a pure white, eggshell pure white by, by Bear. I've got components over here, I've got pieces down here. There's a lot to paint, so we're gonna spend quite a few hours here doing two coats of all, over all of it. So, let's get started. We'll start with the drawers, we'll start with the door, the shelf, the top piece, the knobs, the uh, window holders, and then all of the frame. <laughs> all right, here we go. Two coats of paint on here <laughs> was not a fun project <laughs> at all. So much to paint inside and out, drawers, pieces everywhere, but it's done. So now what we're going to do is we're going to sand, scuff, give it a vintage look. Now, some of you can skip this step if you want a solid white piece. Start taking the tape off, start prepping everything to seal it, and you can move on. But we're going to sand. So we're going to use our old sandpaper. 80 grit, but it's been used, worn down, so it's probably more like 100 grit or even probably like 150 on this piece for sure. We're just going to rough the edges up, give it a little beat in look, nothing too crazy. We'll do the whole piece like that and then we'll clean it up again and go from there. So let's get started. pieces definitely subscribe to our channel um, like us on Instagram give us some comments and feedback but Brant brought this piece home and I thought wow that is way too much work uh, and so not worth it but I think it came out awesome um, just looking at it I was like this would be awesome in like a bathroom and throw some towels in there this drawer opens um, this door opens and then you've got a couple of drawers for storage so I thought that would be really cool we're in a kitchen um, throwing some cool colored dishes in there thought that would be also fun so we can't wait to see this in its next home um, I think it turned out amazing um, and we're really excited for this one oh